shutter speed, along with aperture value, is one of the fundamental properties of exposure, i.e. how much light your camera is exposed to. A faster shutter speed can help freeze the action, whereas a slower one lets in more light, but can result in blurred motion. There tend to be two factors to consider when choosing a shutter speed. How quickly is my subject moving, and how steadily can I hold my camera? For sports and action, you'll need a very fast shutter speed, whereas taking pictures of people, you can get away with something slower, even more so if they're posing for you. But in low light, there's a limit to how long you can hold the camera without shaking it, even if your camera or lens has image stabilization. Working at the other extreme, very long exposures can give some interesting creative effects, blurring the motion of crowds or traffic, or giving a slowing effect to water rather than freezing its movement. But when you're not specifically trying to freeze the action or blur the motion, you're most likely to find yourself setting your shutter speed or letting your camera set the shutter speed in response to your choice of aperture value and the light level in the scene. 